hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's Queenette, and today is another episode of what you people didn't tell me so today i'm going to be talking about an issue that was quite personal to me because this this was really serious for me so before coming to the uk people used to say oh you get a train from anywhere to anywhere at any time of the day transportation is pretty easy you find your way around from anywhere to anywhere blah 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 yeah so i went to work on this day a few weeks ago and we finished late i wasn't rushing because i didn't think um it would be a problem getting home so I got halfway of my journey and I got stuck. <laughs> I got stuck. I couldn't go back. I couldn't go forward. <laughs> I was just stuck because the trains had stopped running. It was almost midnight. I think the trains stopped running at midnight on Sunday. So there were no trains going forward. There was no train going backward. A friend of mine had been saying, oh, check the price of Uber. If you don't find a train, just take an Uber home. And I checked the price of Uber from where I was to the house and it was 60 pounds. <laughs> and I'm like, how much is the work that I want to do that I'm going to be paying 60 pounds for Uber? And the other alternative was to find a bus. And best believe I walked around where I was for almost an hour trying to find that bus because someone at the train station told me oh once i get out of the train station i should go right and walk down and find stop w buses have stops and if you're not at that bus stop <laughs> best believe you're not gonna get on that bus and even when you are at the bus stop sometimes if you don't stay where the bus would see you for you to flag you have to bring out your hand very well and flag the bus so they can see you very well if not your buses will just keep passing you by it happened to me that one is story for another day maybe it happened to me you have to flag the buses for them to see anyway i couldn't find the bus stop w and it was crazy because this was like past 12 a.m and it was really cold i had my coat on thank god for that but i felt i felt really bad that night and you you probably think you've hacked the transportation system but i think the best advice for this will be checking your route every time you need to go anywhere regardless of whether you know where you're going to except is at a peak time of the day or regular time of the day if you're staying out sometimes there are alterations to the train routes except you're very sure and very familiar with that route for me for now i'll just keep checking for every time that i need to go anywhere no matter where it is i'm going to i'm gonna keep check because that's the mistake that i made that night i didn't check my route i didn't check to see that i'm on course to go that way and i'll find a train up until the time when I, I arrived at the next train station which was why i got stuck but yeah it's not as if trains don't run 24 hours they do but what i found out at the end of that whole ordeal was that um saturday and sunday services train services are usually not good not great so you probably need to check um to be sure that you get a train going by the time you're moving with and other on other days from monday to friday maybe you'd get your 24 hours train obviously towards the end of the day when it's no longer peak period they tend to slow down so that if you were if you could get a train say once every 15 or 20 minutes it slows down to maybe once every 30 minutes or once every hour depending on the time of the day basically so yeah your google map your ways or uh, whatever sat nav you're using would be your best friend in your first few months here to get you around to get you familiar with the routes so um you don't get stuck like me and i cannot overemphasize the importance of planning your journey before you head out that's it on today's episode of what you people didn't tell me see you next time and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like and comment on my video thank you so much bye